approximately uh, three miles to the landing site. And there is the runway. Speed. And there's a referred tank view of the uh, Space Shuttle Endeavour as it's coming in for a landing. Gear down and locked. Main gear touchdown. Drag chute deployed by Greg Johnson. Forward gear touchdown. And so after a journey of six and a half million miles, Endeavour landing in darkness, but illuminated by the ingenuity, dedication of every astronaut, scientist, engineer, flight controller, mechanic and dreamer that helped it fly, the fleet's youngest ship completing its 122 millionth mile after its crew delivered an instrument to the International Space Station will sift through the cosmic darkness for years to come. Houston, Endeavour, we'll stop. 122 million miles flown during 25 challenging space flights. Your landing ends a vibrant legacy for this amazing vehicle that will long be remembered. Welcome home, Endeavour. Yeah, thank you, Houston. You know, the space shuttle is an amazing vehicle to fly through the atmosphere, hit it at Mach 25, uh, I mean, steer through the atmosphere like an airplane, land on a runway. It is really, really an incredible ship. On behalf of my entire crew, I want to thank every person that's worked for to get this mission going and every person that's worked on Endeavor. Um, it's sad to see her land for the last time, uh, but she really has a great legacy. Great words. Thank you, Mark. And we will meet you and your crew on 5 3. 5 3. And so the Space Shuttle Endeavour touching down at Kennedy Space Center uh, on time at uh, 1.35 a.m. Central Time, 2.35 a.m. Eastern. Commander Mark Kelly guiding it to a uh, very gentle touchdown on runway 15 at Kennedy Space Center Shuttle Landing Facility.